Hey there everyone, this is Cloud Chief, and today's video I want to take a few minutes and talk to you about coalition assignments. The coalitions are kind of like little mini guilds in the Adelin area that are supposed to help the city of Adelin doing different things to help make the place a lot more inhabitable. There are six different coalitions, and if you want to make a Geo or Rune Fencer ultimate weapon, you need to be at max rank in all six. I am going to go over all of the coalition assignments, but I'm going to do that individually for each coalition and make a video just about that, so that way it's much more targeted. So to rank up at each coalition, you have to do coalition assignments at each individual coalition. How you do this is you go talk to the front desk and then you exchange imprimaturs to be able to do the assignments. You get, when you first start out, you can have a max of 15 and it costs anywhere from 1 to 3 to be able to do an assignment. Choosing to do more imprimaturs at once will actually yield less total bail than if you went and did them individually however you then obviously have to do it three times I of course recommend always using three imprimaturs because it's not that great of a value that it's giving and your time's better spent spending all three just so that way you're making that much progress you'll get a new imprimatur every six hours so just waiting enough time will allow them to accumulate while 15 is the max. However, you can reduce this amount of time and the amount that you can hold by doing a wide variety of different coalition assignments. However, that takes a lot of time and effort and by the time you start getting or being able to hold more and get them faster, you're going to be pretty much done. So I don't even recommend trying to go about getting them unless you want to be doing coalition assignments for XP and bailed on the side, which isn't necessarily a bad thing to do. There are eight different ranks, with Legend being the highest rank, and I'm including the rank that you start on. To rank up, you need to have done... 20 imprimatur missions so to speak so like you can hold 15 max if you do them all at once for one coalition you would need to accumulate five more and then do five more before you can rank up however it needs to be the highest tier coalition assignment available or one tier below it if you're actually doing missions multiple tiers below your highest rank you'll actually get less points so it's best that you're always doing the highest rank or second highest rank and I will get into this more when I talk about the individual coalitions a couple more things before I wrap up this video one is that the XP and bailed that you obtain you get when you turn in the assignment so it is completely possible for you to level up a low-level character and not do any of the assignments on that job so you can go do the assignments on your highest level job and then turn around and pick a level one job and then go turn in the assignments and you will get XP for your low level job. So if you still need to you know, level up a character, this is a good way to get some free XP for it. Also in East Adelin, near the NPC that actually gives you the key item so you can go do skirmish, is a Mithra named Ivan... Holm, if I'm saying that right, and she's located at G8. She will tell you the fame that you have in Adeline, also can tell you what rank you are in all the coalitions. So if you're trying to figure out and you've done a variety of different uh, coalitions and you're not sure what rank you're at at which one, you can go talk to her and she will give you the list all at once rather than having to go to each individual coalition. And that's pretty much it for what I can say about coalitions as a whole. Make sure that you stay tuned for my videos for each individual coalition where I will go into my recommendations for best path to go through just to make it easiest and how to do each one because some of them can be quite confusing and sometimes you don't get a choice early on which, you know, uh, coalition assignments you want to do because they only allow you to do one type until you reach a certain rank. 
So I'll be going into that individually and how best to proceed through them. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got some value out of it. And may you have success in all you do.